Jesus walks into the bustling town of Capernaum. The streets are lined with vendors, and townspeople are busy with their daily tasks. Jesus is calmly walking with his disciples, his presence already commanding attention. Jesus enters the synagogue, a modest building with a high ceiling and an air of reverence. The people inside are seated, listening intently as Jesus steps forward to teach. Jesus is speaking with authority, and the people are astonished by his teaching. His words are powerful, and the atmosphere is filled with a sense of ahorahibbar and reverence. Suddenly, a man possessed by an unclean spirit stands up. His face is twisted in torment, and his voice is filled with fear and anger as he cries out to Jesus, challenging him. The unclean spirit within the man cries out, What do you want with us, Jesus of Nazareth? Have you come to destroy us? I know who you are, the Holy One of God. Jesus calmly but firmly commands the unclean spirit, Be quiet, come out of him. His authority is absolute, and there is no room for defiance. The unclean spirit, in one final act of defiance, throws the man to the ground before leaving him. The man is left exhausted, but freed, while the crowd gasps in amazement. The man slowly gets up, his face now peaceful and relieved. The people in the synagogue are murmuring in awe, realizing they have witnessed a miracle. The people in the synagogue are abuzz with talk. They marvel at Jesus' authority discussing how even unclean spirits obey him. The news of this miracle begins to spread rapidly through the town. Jesus leaves the synagogue with his disciples, the amazed crowd following him. The news of what happened begins to spread through the whole region.